Welcome to All Play Games Weekly, where we bring you a weekly dose of tech news, games, and inspiration. I'm Brian Karsten. I'm William D. Bacari. Batten down the hatches and tighten your wagon wheels, pioneers. Let's get into it. So on this week's episode of All Play Games Weekly, we talk about BlizzCon 2019, the Overwatch League Grand Finals, Sony Worldwide Studios Chairman Sean Layton stepping down, and Sony finally unleashing crossplay. Now, if you missed it, the Overwatch League Grand Finals have concluded with the San Francisco Shock defeating the Vancouver Titans in a clean 4-0 sweep. The Shock was led by MVP Sinatra on Doomfist, who led the charge with a huge opening team fight where he manhandled the Titans. As much as Sinatra controlled the initial engagement, it was his teammate Troyobin who stole the finals MVP with the greatest Sigma play I've ever seen. The Titans could not take space wherever, Tro- wherever Troyobin was set up. If you're a fan of gaming, then this event is one you cannot miss next year. The stands were packed, Zed was performing live in the stadium, and the commentators really made this event feel like the Super Bowl for competitive gaming. Overwatch League is here to stay, with the expected release of up to three new heroes and Overwatch 2 at BlizzCon 2019 on November 1st. Now speaking of BlizzCon, I couldn't mention it without addressing the expected release of my favorite dungeon crawler, Diablo 4 on PC. This should be a huge hit after the Diablo snafu Blizzard put on the world uh, through their mobile release at BlizzCon last year. So, cross your fingers, Pioneers. This should be good. I hope so. In a rather bizarre announcement, Sony Interactive Entertainment Worldwide Studios Chairman Sean Layden departs after 30-plus years with the company. Now, the news comes straight from GameDaily.biz after PlayStation sent out a tweet at 4.05 September 30th stating... It's with great emotion that we announce that Worldwide Studios Chairman Sean Layden will be departing Sony Interactive Entertainment. His visionary leadership will be greatly missed. We wish him success in the future endeavors, and we are deeply grateful for his years of service. Thanks for everything, Sean. The tweet seems simple and straightforward. However, after being at Sony for over 30 years, it's a rather interesting way of letting the public know about this departure. I mean, what do you guys think? Is there anything to this, or was this just simply his time to move on? Let us know below. Sony also just unveiled Crossplay, and now it's awesome. It was in beta for a few months beforehand with titles like Rocket League and Dauntless, but now according to IGN and Wired, Crossplay is now out of beta and available to everyone. Titles benefiting from this are the recently free-to-play Destiny 2 and the new Call of Duty Modern Warfare reboot. It looks like it's finally time to connect with everyone. What do you guys think? Let us know in the comments below. And now, for our gaming tip of the week, here's Overwatch GM Pearson Guest with a bit of insight. What Ryan's doing right now is he's in the head tracking range. Essentially, what he's trying to do is keep at that same head level at all times. Thank you, Pearson, for helping our players achieve the right gaming mindset. As always on All Play Games Weekly, we leave you with a quote from Walt Disney this time. The way to get started is to quit talking and begin doing. So go out there and start doing, Pioneers. Thanks for tuning in, tuning in to this week's All Play Games Weekly. Take care, be well, and we'll see you next week. Thanks, guys.